what they say. Well, you don't have to obey your, your, your family when you, your parents when you're with them, but once you leave, they don't have authority over you like that. Now, we're going to talk about that, but it's a difference. You, you, you're to obey and honor your parents, okay? It's a difference in obedience and honoring. Obedience is there when you live with them. Honoring is a lifetime. You honor them for the rest of your life. But you obey them when you're under their authority. Okay? Once reaching adulthood or the age of accountability, children are held accountable for their own actions. Therefore, they have to choose to do what is right in God's sight. Now, although God established the parent's authority, that doesn't mean that the children are inferior to their parents. Parents are not to treat their children as though they, the children, are inferior to them. And I've seen that. Parents think that they're better than their children. I've also seen the opposite of that. Because we came up in, 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 a, in an era, I, I remember uh, my dad, for instance, he would make sure I had something to eat before he ate. You know, we was in, it was doing rough times. He would make sure I was taken care of before him. But nowadays, it's not like that. You see parents coming out and they looking all clean and and, 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 and and they living good in the world while their child at home hungry and filth, don't have good clean clothes to put on. They, they treat their child as being inferior to them, you know. And, and a lot of them are receiving uh, assistance and through that assistance they're supposed to be taking care of their children, but they're not. They're taking care of themselves. A lot of them go out there. I've seen them with food stamps selling them, you know, which was the food stamps were given to take care of the, the, the unit. You understand what I'm saying? I'm not trying to come against anyone, but the, the children, once, if, if, if God saw it fit to give the gift of children to you, then you should have, the parents should have enough get up about them, enough love for God and, and concern for the children that they honor their, I mean, they uh, prize their children, put them above anything else. But children are valuable, and some of them are so precious. All righty then. <laughs> like I said, parents are not to treat their children as though they, the children are inferior to them. In God's eyes, we are all one. And you can find that in Galatians 3.28. Children are also instructed to honor their parents as well as to obey them. There's a difference between obeying and honoring. To obey is to do what one is told. To honor is to respect and love. Children are to obey their parents while under their care, but the responsibility to honor their parents is for life. You're to honor your. You should always respect your parents. I I don't I I have very low tolerance for children or uh, even adults that talk harsh to their parents. If you to a place where you're so angry that you're going to talk, you're you you're about to talk harsh to your parents, leave. Get out of their presence, because you should always respect them. Because if your children see you talking to your parents like that, what you think they gonna do when they get of age? They are gonna talk to you the same way. You wanna knock the head off. So <laughs> the best thing to do is when you're so angry, don't. I mean, have have respect for your parents. Even if they're not doing what they're supposed to do, even if they're out there doing all kind of things, respect them. Mm -hmm. Don't 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 come against them and talk down to them and belittle them in front of people. I've seen that happen. I've seen what parents, but children get their parents in front of friends and belittle them, whether because some of because maybe the parents on drugs and they talk down to them. Why do you like this? Why are you doing all this? Oh yeah yeah yeah. Okay, that may be true, but that's not the place to do that. If you want to tell them what, what they need to do, you should do it in love and in private. Because so none of us like to be scolded, so to speak, in front of people. Mm -hmm. All that does is cause us to get upset. Mm -hmm. and, and parents should always, children should always honor their parents. Mark your books, we're going to stop here, and we'll pick it up next week. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Father God, we just thank you once again for this opportunity to study your word. 
thank you, Lord, for showing us how we're to treat our children. And we, Father, we thank you for the anointing. We thank you for the gift of children. We thank you, Father, that we are determined to do your will. And we give you praise and honor in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.